Hey Azzy here, in this quick video I will try to explain you like how I just fix audio and video you know problem in Camlink 4K because first time when I was buy this product I was get to see like it's not really working like this audio and video this both are not matching with this really that is coming from and that time I was make the problem that is like I just capture all the thing in OBS like an audio I just recorded an uh, OBS and the video I just recorded an OBS and also all the things that is come from OBS and you know and after this when I see the output I see that lip sync is not matching and that time you know I just sent Corsair this product two times and they sent me new product two times and after this uh, I just talk with them and they they tell me some of the solution but it didn't work but when I talk with the existing user he shared with me that like we have to do everything separately separately that means like you can record a video on OBS but you have to record the audio in different software like audio CD or any other right now if you see here my screen that I'm recording the audio in uh, audio CD and I'm just recording the video in OBS and if you see carefully that I'm just I already you know at recording this video it's separately that you can see currently right now um, if you not understand let me just go here this is the directly it's coming from the screen as you can see and this video it's coming from the camera that means I, I, I just record everything separately right now that you can see this is the video and this is the camera footage so uh, this is the solution mainly that I do now and now let me show you how uh, you can just set, do setup so to do this first of all you can see here this uh, this option plus icon then you have to create an, a scene first of all so let me take a screenshot because last time when I try it it's not gonna work I don't know why so you have to create a scene after this you will get to see here the plus icon just click on and first of all let me just do the display capture first and yeah now you can see the screen right now so first of all you have to click on the plus icon then you can choose here the display capture then you will get to see like this and as you can see now you can see my screen right now and now I'm just going to choose the video capture device it's gonna be the uh, this one this camlink 4k that you can see right now and let's just make it um, this one and okay just let me reduce the size otherwise you can't see me clearly so I'm just going to put it inside and also we have to keep it on an audio right audio input capture it's gonna be like this and you have to choose here camlink 4k so previously I was choose my own microphone like this my, my own microphone and it's good it's not gonna work it's just giving a little bit problem about this lip sync so after this I just select here um, this camlink 4k that is really coming from the camera this is mainly so now it's not making any kind of problem so basically this is the settings that's it and right now if you wanna record it separately I mean if you wanna record something like me that uh, now I'm currently doing on this camera footage I'm directly getting it so if you wanna do like this then you have to do extra plugin you have to install extra plugin on a computer um, it's not plugin you can say it's extension for OBS uh, let me go let me show you go to to add this extension or to enable this let me go to first of all go to filter and as you can see here the option effect filter you have to just choose source record and okay it then um, as you can see we are getting few option so I already installed an extension it's called source record now I'm sure I'm, I'm gonna show you to get the source record option you have to just search in Google source record then you can just search OBS right it's gonna be more better to get it right so um, as you search source of source record OBS then you have to just uh, install this plugin on your Mac or if you're using uh, you know, Windows then just install it just download here and choose whatever you're using right now and just install it on a computer or if you want to watch any kind of tutorial about that 
then just go to YouTube or just okay let me just and just search here source record obvious then you can just watch this video uh, I was watch this and it's gonna work right now all right so uh, let me just remove it all so when you install the extension after this come filter and just turn on here the source of code and you will get to see here this option first of all recording on which you want so now I'm just recording this video that's why I'm not select anything so uh, if you want to directly record then choose recording that's it and the file name extension if you just choose something for example I was type camera because it's gonna be easy for identify which and for hard and in the format it will be the MKV if you want to change it to something different then you can directly change or also you have to do one thing that is you have to choose here different audio and it track one and the since two since two that you know that we recently uh, add the different uh, uh, for uh, this audio so you have to choose the same otherwise it's going to be really hard to just make synchronize so choose the same layer that you choose in here and also just change the bit bit rate into 666 like this 60 zero 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 like this one and just turn okay so profile it will be the high uh, that's it that's it no extra work uh, now I'm not doing anything so I think I don't really need anything so I'm just going to remove it but this is basically the process the setting you have to just make sure that this setting is enable um, then this video will be automatically recorded so before I finish the video, let me show you like how I just connect my camera with the Mac and the capture card. So if you see directly here this uh, Mac, and then Mac Mini, then here I just put in the cable that is coming from the Camlink. I always get this product in the box, and after this I connect with here the Camlink, and after this I put here the cable. Basically, this is the uh, SDMI cable into going to my camera that you can see here just going to directly connect with this and now you, you can thinking why I just not put here this capture card into directly in here because of it was you know if I just going to touch it it's just going too much hot so it's really hard to just keep it every single time on here and just uh, going to be hot so you know if I wait it uh, uh, one hour or two hour if I record it after this I think I can touch it's just going too much hot so that's why I just follow this procedure that can I just uh, I can just keep this cable all the time and I can just put the capture card whatever I just want to record or want I just want to take the shot that's why I hope guys now we understand and now currently that cable I'm using from my, in my camera that mini SDMI to SDMI it's coming from Ubrain mini cable uh, I was I was by this one let me see in Amazon this one is available or not I think you will get this product or you will get something similar uh, like this type of product I'm using currently like this type of thing uh, you can finding out uh, which uh, which one is for uh, your perfect for your camera which one is suitable you can just buy the same product I'm currently using the same uh, it's depend on your camera like it's have mini or micro in my case it's have it's have a uh, mini so this is micro so it's a different something right so you have to make sure that you're just going to buy the right one uh, I hope guys you understand if you have any question about this just let me know or you can just follow the reddit I think uh, because when I get the problem about Camlink 4k uh, Camlink 4k um, not working I just follow the reddit I just follow the reddit and it's have a many solution here as you can see still have problem uh, you can just see there and I hope you will get your solution or try to ask a an, uh, an related person who currently using it or who already use it because existing person or existing user they know mainly how to solve the problem thank you for watching